Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the TVP T50-51. And, oh, okay. Apparently I got good timing, but <laughs> anyways, I'm doing a review on the T uh, TVP. So, um, yeah, this thing, unlike the Bat Chat, I feel like is actually pretty playable. I hate the Bat Chat um, with a passion. I'll probably do a video on the Bat Chat uh, soon, but I hate the Bat Chat. Um, it's one of my first tier tens, and I used to really like it, but it's just fallen really out of favor, and I just don't really like it as much. So this tank is pretty quick. That's pretty uh, known fact about it. It has good power to weight ratio, good engine, uh, good top speed and reverse speed. Um, so what I take, I take the, actually the improved rotation mechanism and the vert stabs because I want to be able to hit every shot in my auto loader. And actually, when I have these two things, it makes my dispersion really, really good. I can hit a lot of shots on the move. So it actually turns the gun into kind of like a Russian medium, if not a, maybe a little touch better. So I really like it. Um, it has a really good aiming time and a really good dispersion. So this tank is definitely not uh, like inaccurate like most auto loaders are. It actually has good gun handling, I would say. And I also have optics because I just like being able to spot. My TV range is about 500 in this tank if you take into account that I also have uh, the, the food, the bukti, and then I have the um, stabilizer greasing. So. Yeah, here's the stabilizer greasing. So what I'm going to do is um, just play a couple games in the thing. I am trying to raise the mark for the 3 mark, um, as you can see here. About 88%. So I am at the same time trying to raise the mark a little bit. So um, yeah, let's, let's get some, a couple of good games here. Let's, let's battle. Earlier today I did, did the 907. Um, that was a little bit ago though. So I'm just now getting back on and I'm doing the TVP now. Some people have been messaging me and telling me to activate Windows. If it really bothers you guys that much to see that in the bottom of the screen, I guess I can activate it. I just don't really want to spend $100 for nothing, basically, just to get that off my screen. But if it annoys you guys, uh, whatever, I'll get it off. Okay, so, Lakeville. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just, since we have two light tanks that are probably both going to scout, um, I'm just going to go and sit in the middle at first and I'm going to try to shoot the crossing. I bet that at least one of their tanks will be able to get shot at by me. Um, as you know, this thing has a really good clip. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you the interclip reload is like probably the best thing about it. It's like a machine gun basically, this tank. And it's, well, and it's uh, full reload is actually pretty good. 22.5 seconds doesn't mean amazing DPM, but it's, um, it means you can stay in the fight. Like, it doesn't, like, put you out of the fight for 40 seconds like the Bat Chat does, which is what I like, or what I love about it. Okay, so... So, as always, we're going to play here in the middle. So... Okay, so, yeah, our EVR is going, so we're just gonna wait for spots. Now, on this map, I don't really ever recommend going into the valley. If you want to hold the valley, that's fine. Uh, from your base, that's okay. But I would never actually go to the valley. We are spotted here. Okay. EBR, one EBR is down. We are spotted, so I need to be careful. But I doubt anything will be able to shoot me yet. Okay, so our EBR is not going to spot anything until this EBR dies, so... Okay, that's fine. So we're just going to reload here. Pull back and reload. Uh, nothing else that really needs to get said. They did take out our EVR very unfortunately. So I'm just gonna, sorry for taking the mic by the way. I'm just gonna kinda just wait right here and just see what happens. This map is always. Okay, so two of their heavies, including their top tier heavy, um, went into the valley. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and actually pressure the city with my team. I know that we can overmatch the city because they sent a lot of their powerful tanks into the valley. So what I'm going to do is. I am going to go and help my team push the city. We have an IS-4 going to the city. Um, amazing. So, yeah, let's go. If I can get a shot on this guy, I'm going to stop and do it. I know I need to be careful not to get spotted by the EGR, but I know I'm probably not going to get spotted by the EGR, so I think it's probably fine. To cross this way to try to get a shot. There we go. This thing doesn't have great armor, but um, he's got unlit. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to continue going to the city. 
my team needs me here. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to play from this position so I can shoot this guy. Oh. Okay, so he can't see us, we can't see him, that's fine. Okay, so we need to push the city. I'm gonna let my team know. Push city. Just so I don't... Okay, I got chat there somehow. Okay, so, um... I'm gonna continue pushing the city, I guess. Uh, my team won't get the hint. Okay, so there's the T10. He actually did not spot me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go ahead and clip him out. If I treat him, it's fine. He actually only tracked me, so... Okay, there's our TVP. He did get two shots into me, that's fine. Um, as you can see, the reload... I'm already almost halfway through the reload. That just puts in perspective how fast it is. So I, I'm gonna be ready to start shooting here. So, so this is why I love the TVP. Its reload doesn't put you out of the game like the bad chat's reload does. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna try to catch this TVP. I'm gonna swing kind of wide, try to shoot him. Okay, there's the 44. I'm gonna put a clip out of him. And beautiful. Okay, so we put a full clip into that guy. Nice. So now I'm just trying to stay in cover, wait for my reload, and then do the same thing over again. This is what you're gonna do in the TVP half the time. You're just gonna kinda just be waiting on your reload. But since the reload isn't actually that long, you'll be fine. So I don't wanna go up high because um the enemy team can easily just snipe me out of that way, so I'm gonna just aim my shots here. Or Chinese tier 10 TV, dude. That's not a good vehicle. <laughs> it's not a good vehicle at all, guys. It's, it has no armor. I think it's one of the rarest tier 10s, actually, as well. That's why. Um, as you can see, my reload is almost already done. This is just kind of the TVP. Right now, this game hasn't really been too, like, you know, in depth. I'm kind of just, like, reloading and clipping people, if I'm being honest. There's not much, like, high tier play going on here. So what I'm going to do is, I just saw this tank's fire, so I'm just going to get it. clip this grind top. And that's okay, I took a hit from the, uh, the Udez, that's okay, I don't really care. Okay, so we clipped out that uh, Urimatol, kind of with a little bit of help from that ammo rack. Which is fine. Okay, so now, what I'm going to do is actually, I'm going to fall back, and I'm going to try to get a spot kind of like where this pattern is. Because I actually, there's more tanks back here than I expected to turn around. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fall back and try to just do a little bit of damage from range. I don't know exactly what my camera rating is in this, so I need to be a little bit careful. So my goal is I'm going to try to get shots on these uh, mediums that are sitting in the corner. Uh, don't know why it was not letting me go up that tiny little hill. Okay, I think what I just did was a massive waste of time. I didn't expect them to crumble as fast as they did. But, you know, better safe than sorry, right? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to rush in here and I'm just going to get a clip off. And then the game's going to be over. Oh, TVP. Of course, that bounced the TVP twice. <laughs> it's okay, though. Everything's alright. I actually should be able to get another clip off, if I'm not mistaken. 15, 14, 13. Yeah, I'll be able to get another clip off for sure. Um, if that EA, if that AE phase one is still alive, which I think he will be. So okay, so I'm gonna get one more clip off. I didn't realize I only reloaded one shell. It shouldn't matter too much. And yeah, I made a mistake only reloading one shell. I didn't realize that I was out of AP already. Um, but yeah, it was a GG nonetheless. <laughs> a little mistake in the game there, just no ammo awareness. My bad, I know you're pr probably cringing at the replay of that. Um, it's okay, we did about 6.1k combined, which is always nice. Um, I feel like my marker is, uh, was raised a little bit from that, which is nice, so... Let's take a look at the battle results and we'll play one more. Okay, so high caliber. Um, yeah, we did about 5.8k raw, and then we had a, a little bit of tracking damage from that Chinese TD. Perfect. Okay. Um, I actually gained credits because I was actually shooting AP the whole time, which is nice. Uh, pretty quick game, 6 minutes and 30 seconds. Okay, so let's just check the mark before we go on. 
Okay, so it looks like I rose by almost a percentage point. So if you do about, it looks like 6K, looks like you raise about a percentage point. Okay. On in the next. Okay. So this is kind of tricky. But what I'm going to do is, depending on what my team does, I need to be really careful about what my team does. If my team is willing to help me, I'm going to go ahead and actually take the K0 area. And why will I do that? Well, because I'm a top tier medium, and um, I can clip the other guy out. I can clip the guy that comes out there. If I have help, I can easily take them out. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to the K0 area quickly. I usually don't like making chancy plays like this, but I'm just going to do it because I have high confidence. Because there's only one top tier medium per team. Now, there is another TVP, but... Um, I'm just going to take my chances with this. I'm just going to see what my team is doing, and we don't have anyone helping me. So, okay, so change of plans. I'm actually not going to do that. I'm actually going to go help the no one. Um, if I went over to the zero, uh, zero line, I'm going to die, so... Yeah, so we are kind of forced with our team here to just kind of play the, the west, unfortunately, so... Okay, so this is not good. I think I'm going to be spotted by this guy. So I'm just going to try to get up here and just start helping the fight a little bit. I could go where the C4 is if I wanted, but um, at first I'm just going to see what I can do over here. I don't really like sniping like all the time. I kind of like a little bit of action, so this is what I'm doing. There's the T10. He's spotted for my team. If my team elects to shoot at him, that's one thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go over here and I'm going to try to uh, shoot these tanks. I feel like we kind of have a little bit of an overmatch over here because we have our SCON and uh, 5A and two of our tanks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and I'm going to clip one of these tanks out. I feel like the T-57 is reloading since he's backing off and not reloading. So what I'm doing is I'm going to clip this guy out. Uh, my team blocked me. I don't know why they would do that, but they did. So, okay. Perfect. I already finished this off him. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of chill here. And we're just going to continue to pressure this side. So we kind of have pinched them here, is what we've done. Uh, they do have three TDs, so I'm not going to beat that. Okay, there we go. We have spotted one of their T-30s. Perfect. Okay, so let's continue pressuring this side. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to go clip this 60 TP in the side. Um, hopefully his 5A decides not to block me. He does a good job of not blocking me. Good job, buddy. Okay. Gonna get one last shot in on our clip. Uh, no, I'm just gonna go ahead and get the reload because I don't think we're gonna be pushing them within five seconds or so. Yes, yeah, so I'm just kind of reloading here. I would push now, but I only know where one of their, their TDs is. So what I'm gonna do is, if I see the 60 TP fire, I'm gonna go. Guys, if he doesn't, oh well. Okay, there's their uh, Chinese TD. So I'm gonna go ahead and just clip this guy out. I'm gonna take a hit. I know for sure I'm gonna take a hit, and that's just fine. I think it's worth it. So we traded about 700 for 900, which is fine. Okay, so there's the T30. Perfect. Perfect. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually go behind their team. I'm gonna go here, and I'm just gonna take out this T30. That's what I'm gonna do next. I'm going to be able to spot through Artie as well. So. Actually, I'm going to take out this one. Perfect, okay. So we need to be careful about their TV because the TVP has not been spotted. Okay, so there's their T55A. Alright, I'm going to just dive on this T30. That's what I'm going to do. He looks like he's reloading. Ooh, that's not good. I want to find an angle to kill this T30 without getting killed. Very nice. 
nice. There's a Leo PTA in the open. Perfect. So what I'm gonna do finally is I'm just gonna spot these last two tanks on the enemy team. And there's the PvP. I should get a little bit of spotting damage for this. Okay, looks like the TV is gonna hide behind this hill. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna come into this bush and start shooting him. So this is gonna be another pretty quick game. Might only get one more shot off. Nope. Oh, okay, we live. Okay, so another very good result. Oh, I didn't realize there's an already left. My guess is he's over at the K0 area because he could easily get there because we didn't have any of our team there. Okay, yeah, he shot at me. And it's GG. Alright. So another pretty good game. All right. Okay, so we got a first class from that. Um, about let's see here, about um, two point two. Uh, I mean. 6.7k combined. Okay, so another pretty nice game. Alright, uh, I think that's all for today. Um, so, as you can see, TVP is very bursty tank. Um, decent dispersion, as you can see. It actually hits its shots, unlike the bat chat. And, you know, it's still pretty quick and has a pretty good view range if you do what I do with it. So, yeah, I, I actually really enjoy the TVP. It's one of my favorites. I don't. It's definitely not overpowered or anything like that, but it's definitely one of my favorite tanks to play because it's. I think it's really fun. I like its bursty style and the fact that you don't have to be out. Because the one thing that annoys me about normal auto loaders, um, is that they take like 40 seconds to reload, and I hate that. The TVP reloads in 20. It feels like you're not even taken out of the fight. It feels like you just have a tank with a long reload, but you're still in the fight. It just. I like I just like that. It's kind of like the T57 in a way, except the T, uh, it actually hits its shots on like the T57. So, yeah, that is my review of the TVP. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, make sure to uh, like the video or dislike it if you disliked it, and make sure to subscribe if you want to see more of these reviews. Okay, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.